Retribution. Here comes Sam, you know what I'm saying? Two in the head. That make us even. I'm a beast, man. What's poppin'? It's the Double G, and welcome back to another episode of Mafia. And um, we got ourselves in some shit right now. Like, we gotta find a way to evade the police. Oh, there's a couple different ways you could go. Maybe we gotta have a shootout, bro. Maybe we gotta take our time with this. Come on. Or maybe these cops are too smart for a shootout, cause... My boy. Fuck yeah, you guys are shooting at me. I'm gonna shoot right fucking back. You go over there, I'll hop right up on here. What's up? What's up? Oh my god! I didn't blow off his leg? Let's go. Let's go. Come on. I will fucking take off right now. Easy. Dome shots. Yo, I'm nasty. I'm nasty with these headshots. Okay, going up here was a mistake the first time. Okay. Is there any more cops? Okay, we gotta go. Where you at? Where you at? Sorry, my boy, but not today, you feel me? We can do some some quick thinking. Yo, that, that's some crazy shit. Oh my god. Tommy, you're a son of a bitch. Escape through the church. We're at the church. We're at the funeral. Shit just got even more serious then, bro. So. Oh, shit. This is where shit might take a real, no even realer fallen, turn. We can find redemption in death. Now, William, he was a sinner, yes, but he was also a loving son, a protected brother. I think it was a bitch. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. 
And now I believe one of Billy's closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. There he is. I uh I just wanted to pay my respects. Billy, I never said this, but I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good. What are you doing? Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy. Damn, dude. Are you serious? Oh, come on, Tommy. Where's Sam, bro? You thought? You thought you were gonna throw one of them at me? No, bro. All right, niggas got choppers. Niggas got choppers. I don't know where he at with that, with that shit, but we got to be careful. Oh, we smooth with it. Oh, we got to kill Johnny. Oh, shit. Shit, I'm already upstairs. But where's Sam at? You could have stopped all this days ago. Where's that at? Shooting from across. So we need to get these long shots in, y'all. Where y'all at? Come on. You don't want the smoke? It, there you are. Oh, why you did? Come on, bro. Stop ducking. Come on. Need the ammo. Oh, he's the one with the chopper. Dome shot? And I didn't even know I had it like that. We good. We good. His father was here. His father. This is the way this city works. Oh, you give me the Tommy gun like a real mafia dude? He covered his ass perfectly. We gotta catch up to him. Yo, he is schmoovin'. Dome shot. Shh, nigga. What have you done? Murder in the house of God. These men were criminals, father. Thieves. Rapists. Killers. And God would have embraced them if they'd asked for forgiveness. Hey, shut your Which ass up, dude. Men might have sought redemption by working with the poor. Which one might have saved just one life? None of us, father. You bastard. If you have any confessions to make, you better do it quick. No more bloodshed, please. I'm sorry, father. <sighs> Consider this an act of divine retribution. Here comes Sam, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Two in the head. That make us even. Sure. 
for no. For your trouble, father. I don't want your blood money. You took theirs. Not a lot of difference from where I'm standing. Oh my god, that's that real shit. There should be enough dough to patch up the bullet holes and keep you quiet. So you you point a cops come. You point a finger, you're done. You tell them the but, gunman who did this had East Coast accents. Must have been from out of town. Right? I won't lie. But I won't say anything at all. Good. Be a shame if we had to come back here. On some real Where shit. Where you? As soon as I walked in the church, the crew recognized me. Followed me straight back out. Where are they now? The same place as all these guys. Come on. We gotta go. Yeah, we out this bitch. Are you serious? Isn't this the hearse? Why did it take so long to get in the hearse? Come on! We out this bitch. Bro, look how much health I lost because of you, bro. Come on, Sam. Don't bring the cops well, with today you. Didn't turn out like I expected. Just drive. Or we'll end up in the back. So we gotta make a smooth getaway, y'all. They are on our ass, though. This ain't no European. Whatever you did at the cat house got the cops plenty pissed. Yeah, it was messy, but I got everything done. Everything? Yeah. Everything. Cars reported him in North Park. Yo, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> they giving up yet? I don't think so. They must have called out every cop in the city. Alright, well they ain't gonna turn around in time to catch up to us. So as long as we gas it, get across this bridge, we, we Gucci. The guy's gotten away in North Park someplace. Come on, Tommy, lose him. I'm trying. Oh, he caught up. They caught up. Ooh. I evaded that one swift, y'all. That's how you lose the police right there. That's how you lose the police right there. Cops ain't touching me. Thank Christ. Gonna be trying to forget today for a long time. You're telling me. Let's get back to the bar. We gotta lie low. The way this all went down, we gotta lie low for weeks. Ah, the priest will keep his trap shut. Don't worry. Morello got a bloody nose, and you and Polly are in the clear for whacking Galati's son. Boss will be pleased. Yeah, we put in we put in some serious work, dude. So we should be cool. But fuck that was messy. I still say we should have plugged Michelle. But fuck, dude. All of this is going to come back to bite on the ass, bro. I could feel it. Something this big. Yeah, this is all because of Sarah. Let's keep that. I mean, fuck, you know. For helping me out back there. This is all for baby girl. It's not anything you wouldn't do for me. I know. But when you come that close to biting it, Christ, it's something. Don't need to tell me about that. Just don't think about it. Best lesson I could ever teach you. Don't think about anything. Whoo! That's some rough advice, yo.
intermezzo. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Tommy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. And I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know I could take you in right now, put your volume bars, tell you old and gray. Maybe. If you think you can make any of it stick. But then you'd never know about Murillo. Hey, fellas, I'd keep you waiting. My shift has started. What you having? Two lunch vessels, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. All Ooh. right, we've come this far together. Don't forget we'll that McMuffin, nigga. From the church. Don't forget that McMuffin. It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. Wow. We just had to lay low for seven, eight months. The cops kept showing up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. Seven to eight Frank months. Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. When I recovered some account books from Morello's offices, 33 was a pretty good year for him. Bastard knew we were bleeding out before we did. While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. One of our regular pickups suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. You need it and catch on. Not me. I think maybe Polly smelled something. But even with the cops looking over our shoulders and Morello circling, we were still making good money. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do, except drink. Have a few laughs. Every time I went into Celieri's, there was Sarah. So it was a good year. Until Frank. Coletti, a dance can sit there. Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. He set us all straight. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. Mm. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and buy everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with her, though. Then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. Oh, shit. I'm trying to teach you the ropes so you don't get strangled by them. You ever have a dog, Tom? Sure. Little mud when I was a kid. When I was eight or nine, before I came over from Sicily, I had this beautiful skinny Cerneco de Letna. Like a little greyhound. Fastest dog you've ever seen. That's how I met the Don. We started setting up races together. Betting on her with coins and rifle shells. Yeah, real nigga shit. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. We were only out the pocket knife, but I never saw the Don so angry. She got old on you? No. Pregnant. She went into heat, got out of the yard, and every dog in town had a turn. You're like that dog, Tommy. Every time you flash your money around, you're a bitch in heat, and everyone in that club is now looking to fuck you. And once you get fucked, you're no good to us. Damn, bro. Do you understand? Yeah. yeah you made your point. I'm gonna call this nigga yeah. Alfred, bro, because he remind me of you Alfred from Batman. Look, Paulie's at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. Sam is loyal, but he has no vision. But you, Tommy. You could run this town someday. Damn. Well, I appreciate that, Frank. So, uh, Alfred, a real what one. happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. I broke his nose. Wow. You can let me off here. You Sarah my best, Tommy. He's like, oh, you know? 
Uh, everybody probably know, you know what I'm saying? That's baby girl. That's baby girl. Frank a real one. This was that was some real shit. Back then, everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Uh. Ah, Tom. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back. Eh? You got the job, I think. Thanks, Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. In this rain? <laughs> She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. Hmm. So that's going to do it for this episode. I don't want it running too long. It's like 20 minutes right now. And I've been playing for a couple, maybe a couple hours you even. Know, so. Oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, I'll catch y'all next time. Like, subscribe, comment, tell me what y'all think. All that good mess. Don't forget, don't forget to hit that notification bell. Frank, Peace. Is it going to be?